Um, hey guys, I'm Nitin, and uh, today I am going to demo uh, a minor UI modification which we kind of did this week uh, with respect to test query flow. So we have uh, a test testing of Oracle queries um, uh, functionality in our D app. So which basically helps you to test an Oracle whether to get what kind of data, is it actually getting data or something like that. And uh, so it's just a UI bump this week, nothing fancy. And uh, uh, basically it's again like a four step process of testing an Oracle, Oracle query. And uh, uh, at first uh, uh, we just want to explain what kind of, uh, what is an Oracle and what Oracle are we using to um, do. So right now we're using oracleize.it which kind of pulls in all the data and you can uh, use that. And uh, yeah, so let's get started. I'll just like select the data source. And uh, so basically it's just a simple uh, explanation. You can read through what exactly how, uh, what exactly this means and what exactly a data source means and stuff. So we have a bunch of other data sources as well. We have data source from Wolfram Alpha and any computation data source which you can do so let's just select URL over there. And then uh, uh, we ask you to uh, enter a test query basically in order to test it. So uh, here's some of a bunch of example which we have right now. Uh, I'll just go ahead and copy this and try pasting over here. And uh, yeah, so now again, uh, we have our gas settings. So for each uh, Oracle query testing, we will be needing gas to deploy it. So I'll just do this and it says invalid address let's see what's going on with it did i miss something oh i think i haven't connected with metamask let's give me one second The joys of live demos. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? Yes, let me put this. And yeah, I mean, it's, uh, I think once it pops up the MetaMask. And yeah, um, cool. I mean, um, so right now, uh, the testing of query takes quite a bit of time, Robert, so I don't, I suggest us to kind of um, stop the kind of demo over here and then um, basically I just uh, tell you the result what exactly the query does. 